Alright, what's going on? Everybody is the best fusion. Welcome back to another video on the channel. It's been quite a while since I've done a, a video like this. Um, in terms of an unboxing video and in terms of a review, it has been quite a while. About a month or two. Anyway, today we have a very special parcel that arrived. Or I should say I bought it's from sneak once again and i'll quickly explain what it is so around winter every single year or so sneak uh, have been since the year 2009 uh, when i first tried it and when it first came out sneak have been doing a seasonal flavor which is related to winter theme called blizzard now blizzard is an ice lemonade normal lemonade type of flavor it's one of the most overrated, highly anticipated, and a flavor that everybody loves, and it sells out very, very quickly. Now, this year was very, very different, however. They were going to bring it back, they announced, but they were also going to be bringing a collector's box along with it, and a couple other things as well, uh, like a hoodie. You have to buy that separately, and more strangely, a snowboard, like an actual real life snowboard for quite a lot of money now i wasn't interested in that what i was interested in and i had enough money for it was the collector's box now i already have the legacy box as if you have been on my channel for a while and you have seen that you will know that I bought the Legacy box the day that it launched and I still have the flavors still and I have you know the shaker now which I haven't used and I have the two tubs which if you don't know what the Legacy box was it was essentially a sort of flashback to when they like when Sneak originally started they had Blackout which was a black cherry they had Unreleased which is a flavor to this day I still don't know what it is and then they released a limited edition glow in the dark shaker all of these have been released in the past but all of them were limited edition at one point and for one time only for newcomers and new fans of sneak they brought the legacy box back this however has been coming out every year the flavor anyway and it's in a box in a box so i'm gonna have to be very very careful there we go is that the top okay that's this is the top so here we are. This is the Blizzard Collector's Box. And I'm going to go through with what you get in this in a minute. But I just want to say, uh, this Collector's Box was £60, um, which is about $60, $65, $70, €75, Euros, give or take. This is very, very limited. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, hang on. I think it tells you what number that I have. I am the. F I think I'm the third person to get it, because it says collection number three. I have that has to be the case. But this was sixty quid uh, plus delivery, which I got next day, which actually was next day because it's normal next day work. Ne oh, it's next working day is what it's meant to be. But I got it today, which is a Saturday. I paid $5.99 for the free the next day delivery. So I got it today, which is a Saturday. So they, they clearly do have DPD workers work the Saturday. But yeah, I must be collection number or order number three to get this. Because I was I was right on the website. Like I immediately got on the website. And apparently the website wasn't actually working for some people. Um, both in Europe and in the UK so I'm trying to be very very careful not to ruin this box but that's the sliding thing that it comes in which is very very nice now I will review the flavor out at some point um, just not now because I want to unbox this and I just want to show you all what we're working with oh my god look at that look Look at that. That is amazing packaging. I'm not even going to lie. This is the type of packaging I wouldn't mind them doing all the time when it comes to these boxes. These are very, very flimsible and very protective. Okay, um, where do we start? I suppose we should 
start with but we'll start with the tub uh, we're not going to be re reviewing this but this is the blizzard tub and i just want to say right off the bat third edition so it's a third edition year that they're doing it this tub looks awesome i love love it really i really do like it really shiny on the camera there it's, well it's actually shiny in real life as well that is beautiful and the thing with these flavors or the thing with blizzard uh, the flavor anyway is that they did announce on instagram and that that they would be bringing it back if they were to sell out during winter so you don't have to worry about them being gone forever it's seasonal flavor so at some point they are going to be bringing them back if they sell out like during the winter but when spring hits that's pretty much it you have to wait until next winter in order to get it so here is the next metal shaker this is um now my second metal shaker from sneak i got the original black one and now i have this one right here which is the limited edition blizzard one i think this is like once it's gone it's gone type of deal but it could be incorrect yeah the inside of it's still the same and now i don't know how i'm supposed to get now this one is a it's a rugby uh pluck thing um that, that they use not rugby i seriously just said rugby this is a um, hockey uh, pluck thing that they use in, you know, uh, hockey with this ice and that. I'm going to be honest, I've never watched a, a hockey game in my entire life, so I don't know. But, I mean, this is kind of cool. I mean, it makes sense because of Blizzard, I guess. But, yeah, it's a po hockey puck, um, puck thing. Uh, I don't know where I would put it. To be fair, I'd probably just keep it in here. Um, slides back in it does it slides back in like a charm so yeah the metal shaker um the flavor itself and the hockey pluck which um i'll get some use out of this box is really really amazing i am going to slide it back in here however and i'm going to keep it stored and safe but when we do a review on the actual flavor, which we will be doing at some point in the next couple of days. So yeah, the um, collector's box comes. Uh, I'm, I'm aware they sold out. Uh, they're sold out already in the UK. So if you're hoping to get one, you're going to have to be lucky and pray that someone is selling one on Facebook or what have you. But to recap, the collector's box was 60 quid plus the delivery, which was 65 um, well, 599, so it was about 65, 66 I paid. It comes with the second metal shaker they've ever done. It comes with the Blizzard flavor, which is sweet. I still don't, ice lemonade, normal lemonade, I still don't know. And it comes with a hockey pluck thin, which um, I'm, I honestly wish they just rather left it out and maybe just, you know what, it's a it's a cool collection thing, I suppose. That's why they, I, they put it in there. Hockey, winter-related blizzards. But we will do the review of the flavor at some point, and I think I might use the, um, the metal shaker as well to, you know, fit the theme. But uh, the box itself, in terms of design, I love the front of it, the little sliding thing that comes with it. It's really, really cool. And it's cool that they tell you, um, if I'm correct, unless this is this is meant to be, like it says collection number three, I don't know if that's meant to be the year, the year that it came out, which is the third year, or if it's meant to be maybe in the third person to get the collector's box, which it seems like that's the case. Negative 37 degrees, sneak in the bottom, 2022. The back of it's nothing special, and the rest of it's um, fairly good. That's really, really nice, not even gonna lie. But that is all really, you know what? To com Let's quickly do a comparing, and it's been quite a while. So, this is the um, legacy box. I don't know how I'm gonna be able to, you know what? Here we go. So, 
This is the Blizzard one, and this is the Legacy one. Now, graphically wise, the Legacy one definitely beats it. But in terms of clean smoothness, the Blizzard one is the winner. So graphic wise, it's definitely going to the Legacy box. But in terms of smoothness and just how clean it is, it's definitely going to the Blizzard box. I think I do prefer this one graphic wise, but Blizzard one, it's more clean. So yeah, I'm gonna wrap the video up there. Um, I'm not gonna do the review until a day or two. This has been me unboxing the Blizzard collection box from Sneak Energy. I love it, I really do. It's now the second box I've bought from them. And it certainly won't be the last either. And with that being said, thank you all very much for watching the video. If you did enjoy the video, please make sure to hit the like button. Possibly share it with a friend, family, or relative. And check the description below for my Instagram and my Twitter. I'm always active on Instagram, and I'm no longer active on Twitter. So that's a lie. I am. Um, just I don't care about Twitter anymore. So yeah, I'll see you all in the next review that we do, which will be the Blizzard flavor review. Yeah.